Get out, Jay! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! And ball appeals and penalty. Less than 10 minutes gone, and Albion will have the chance to take the lead from the spot. Well, it's Evan Ferguson, hands on hips, who's stepped up and faces Joe Whitworth, who's doing his best to put Ferguson off. Ferguson rifles it down the middle, and Albion lead after 10 minutes in the derby. They've made a bright start, and they've been rewarded for it. Smash straight down the middle. No chance for Whitworth. Nicely done by Ferguson. Robertson. In it goes. Great delivery. Flick just wide. Visitors threatening an equaliser there. It's a corner. She came off a Brighton player. Now Todd Miller, into the middle, opportunity here if it's prodded through, it is, shooting chance, tucked in field, should be two, and it's looped off the crossbar. Oh, reprieve for Crystal Palace, it should have been a doubling of Albion's lead, but the finish here was crowded out, Mark Leonard challenged, it looped up and hit the crossbar. Oh, fortune favouring the visitors there. Already gifted Seagulls the lead. With an error leading to a penalty. Evan Ferguson duly dispatched, but uh, that really should have been two. It is two. Well, they threatened just seconds before and Crystal Palace, architects of their own downfall. A poor touch, gobbled up, and Evan Ferguson doubles his tally and his team's tally for the evening. Albion firmly in charge of this one. Oh, another mistake, should be three. And Whitworth to the rescue. Wasn't the best finish from Leonard, but Crystal Palace really making life difficult for themselves at the back. Touch from a fire. Oh, what a flick. True on goal, Moran. Chance for three. Moran saved again by Whitworth. It's all Albion. Given away there, Palace. Stride forward, looking for a goal back. Smartly done as well. Touched in field, real chance this, great block, and again. Ed turns at the heart of it. It's Raksaki. Into Boateng. Neat flick, Robertson. Big chance, and rifled into the side netting. Should have been 2-1. Good chance this. Raksaki, real chance for 2-1. It's blocked first, but then Crystal Palace do halve the deficit. They've battled hard since going two behind. And that was slid home. Raksaki sliding it in. Wells Morrison missing it, but Raksaki making no mistake. Cross it goes, McGill saved, and again. Palace can't believe they're not level. It would have been fortuitous, but Tom McGill just about managing to keep this out. Great work down the left, fizzed across, didn't grab it, almost presenting it straight to street. All over the top, a fire is watchful. Not once, but twice. Well, that may fall, and McGill makes a double stop again. Through it goes, real chance for Palace this, and it's past the post. Good 
for shooting chance. Rifle goalwards and Whitworth at full stretch tips it away for a corner. Furlong on the overlap, crossing opportunity, whistled across and a real chance to extend the lead. Somehow it hasn't gone out and uh, Crystal Palace on the break. Here come the visitors. It's Banks. Rolls it to the left. Omilabu over the bar. They think there's a touch. Goes the kick. It's rather ballooned in the air. It is back in. It's wide. Here they come again. Good running. Good cross as well, Gordon. Working hard in tight spaces. It's rifle goalwards and it's a great stop. It's Pupion. Good touch. Tolage shapes it nicely out to Furlong. Crossing chance again. And Moran goes down and the referee says no. Here was the penalty appeal again. Well, the referee is right there. He has a good long look at it and says no. So Spong with the free kick. Four minutes of normal time remain. Albion looking to score the third. Beaten away by Whitworth. Dicker scooping it back in. Tolage goes down and then Pupion firing it straight at the keeper. Pupion. Striking chance and it dribbles just past the post. Now rolls. Songi fouls his man. A rugby challenge there from Gary Dicker and it all gets a little spicy. The red card for Rolls, the substitute. Headed on. Oh, McGill spilt it. It has now been dealt with, but McGill almost committing a terrible error. There's another poor challenge there by Robertson, and that is it. A frantic end to an entertaining derby, all goals in the first half, that brace from Evan Ferguson, first from the spot, the second following a Palace error that he gratefully gobbled up. Raksaki had pulled one back, but Albion are back to winning ways against their great rivals. It ends here, Albion two, Crystal Palace one.